Okay, this app is called First Then Visual Schedule, and uh, it's a way of uh, carrying around uh, your iPod or your your uh, iPhone. Uh, I have it on the iPad, and it's blown up to twice the size. Um, but it's originally made for the iPhone or the iPod Touch. Um, but it's a way of carrying around a schedule that, uh, if you have a child that's nonverbal or has a, an issue communicating. Um, using words then they can use this device to do that. So let's go ahead and have a look at some of the schedules and uh, give you an idea of what this is about. We'll just go through these quickly and I'll show you how it works. So morning routine you'll come on and uh, this is fully, the good thing about this is it's fully customizable to uh, include any picture you want and uh, use uh, any recording of any picture also. So basically you can do this in a number of ways by scrolling like this. Now remember we're looking at a, a morning routine so obviously getting dressed, putting on our shoes, having breakfast, brushing our teeth, combing our hair, getting a backpack onto the school bus and uh, going to play soccer. So you can, like I said, you can look at it in a number of different ways. This is the full mode way of looking at this. Let's look at split mode and this makes it go um, vertically okay and it's kind of nice when it's on the iPad um, although this is meant for the smaller devices but it works very well on the iPad and uh, let's look in list mode and it's again it's a bit smaller and so on. Now you can imagine putting a list together like this for your child and on each one of these um, although this doesn't do it yet because we haven't set it up you can have uh, it says something on each of the pictures, so you would click and it will eventually say something. Let's go ahead and look at how we do that. Um, just very quickly go through these routines. This is an ABA morning routine. Um, so the monkey game followed by the puzzle, potty, wash hands, have a snack, uh, shoes on, sandbox play, swing play, arts and crafts, wash hands, all done. So that's another way of looking at that. And again, in the different modes back to full mode. Uh, so it works very nicely in between all of these uh, operations. It works very, very well. So um, you can do this. First potty, uh, then computer. And that's a very simple one. So first potty, then computer. And of course you can make lists and lists and lists of things like this that you could use this for. And again, you can look at it in other modes. Now let's go a little bit deeper into this. Um, you can edit any of these. So, for example, you can add a schedule, but let's just play around with editing a schedule on the morning routine, just to show you. So, use the toilet. Let's go on there, and let's record a sound. Use the toilet. We can play that back. Use the toilet. And we can save it. I'll save that again. And go back out of edit schedules to home, go into my schedule, look at the morning routine, use the toilet. And now you see you've included your voice on one of the cards. So again, use the toilet. Going into all the different modes, use the toilet. You can, uh, it's just incredible. You can do anything you want. Uh, you can get pictures from the picture library that's on the app, or you can obviously go to Google Images and download them to your computer and then upload them to the device. Let's go back out and look at something else. Um, let's look at adding a schedule. So let's just call this uh, test and return. Oh, save. Um, and then let's edit the schedule. So we go to test and what we want to do is want to start uh, adding some images. So we can do this two ways. We can pick images from the pictures I have here uh, on my uh, device um, or you can pick from the stock images. So quite an extensive list of pictures here that you can go through and um, you know you can make up anything and of course you can add to these as much as you like just by going on Google um, or taking from your own, uh, you know, your own library. So, um, I don't know, let's see, if we go down to, uh, 
wash hands. I'll just do a couple of these just so you see how it works. Save that. Wash my hands. Add another step. Let's go in and let's do some art. Do some painting. And we'll add one more. Um, you could basically add anything you like and of course this is all to do with your own morning routines. I'm just trying to show you an example of things you can do. Um, eat some fruit. We would have washed our hands normally, but we'll <laughs> leave it at that for now. Eat some fruit. So you get the idea how simple this is, and I'm just using stock images from the from the program, um, and there are, there are a lot of photos on there. So when you go back out, back out to the home screen, you'll now look on my schedules, test we just made, and here we go. Wash my hands. Do some painting. Eat some fruit. And there you are. And you've, you've basically created a, a very simple list to follow. Um, some structure to their daily routine um, and this is a very affordable app so um, being with having the flexibility that this has I think is absolutely great um, again you can look at it in split mode and list mode wash my hands do some painting eat some fruit and that's what it's all about and um, of course you know make as many lists as you like and uh, add as many pictures as you like but um, uh, first uh, then schedule uh, visual routines it's uh, it's a great app